The pack answered with one deep, crashing bark that sounded in the night like a big tree falling. It is Matt, they cried. Stay with Lee's, said Mowgli to Lafour. We shall need every tool. Fowl and Akela must make ready the battle. I go to count the dogs. It is death, one Tola cried, half rising. What can such a hairless one do against the red dog? Even the striped one, remember. Thou art indeed an outlier, Mowgli called back. But we won't speak when the dogs are dead. Good hunting all! He hurried off into the darkness, with wild excitement, hardly looking where he set foot, and the natural consequence was that he tripped full length over Ka's great coils, where the python lay watching a deer path near the river. Kasha, said Ka angrily, is this jungle work to stamp and tramp and undo a night's hunting when the game are moving so well too? The fault was mine, said Mowgli, picking himself up. Indeed, I was seeking leave, Flathead, but each time we meet, thou art longer and broader by the length of my arm. There is none like thee in the jungle, wise, old, strong, and most beautiful Ka. Now whither does this trail lead? Ka's voice was gentler. Not a moon since the was a manling with a knife threw stones at my head and called me bad little tree cat names because I lay asleep in the open. I and turned every driven deer to all the winds and Mowgli was hunting and this same flathead was too deaf to hear his whistle and leave the deer roads free Mowgli answered composedly sitting down among the painted coil.